Hi everyone. This Joe. Welcome to my third class. Recently, character creator function becomes massive. Adding much features on skin and makeup. To understand how skin gen is working, we should know the system logic. And what skin gen want to achieve. The texture maps. Today I will explain every texture maps in detail. So to help you understand what outcome the skin gen want to achieve. In character creator, there are revolutionary improvements on the textures maps. And the mesh is becoming perfectly smooth. So the texture detail becomes more accurate. Firstly, let's talk about color base map. Traditionally, it is called diffuse map. It defines the color of the skin. Secondly, opacity map. In many 3D applications, it is called alpha. Dark color represents the mask to make object transparent. It's important to know, alpha is helping skin gen to match textures on human parts. I will talk about it in part 2 of the tutorial. Thirdly, the bump map. Generally, it calls normal. It uses green, red and blue to define the surface details. While normal define the affected area. Displacement define the depth of such detail. In general, dark color makes surface sunk, light color makes surface rays. Next, AO. It defines how objects absorb ambient light. Black color means no ambient light be reflect on skins, so the shadow is darker. Next, Metallic map. Traditionally, it calls specular. It defines the shininess of the surface. Light color makes it shiny and looks like metal. Metallic map always used together with roughness. Dark color makes skin reflective, which causes the wet and oily effect. Next, displacement map. In other 3D program, it is height map. As mentioned, displacement is used to define the depth. That's the intensity of the normal map. The lighter the color, the more protruding is the surface. It's good to use to make the monster skin. Next, glow map. As its name, it makes light to the surface. Finally, bland map. It's often ignored by the user. But it is a great tool to create dirt, mold and mud effect. It makes overlay color to adjust the diffuse map. In addition, Character Creator allows you to export the texture map. And modify it in Photoshop. You could also export the UV map as your reference. As well as import your own map by double click. Now I have just introduced the basic concept of texture maps. You make questions? How about skin gens? Actually, skin gens is a tool to asset in building such build skin textures. Makeup is used to add and diffuse, opacity and blend map. Skin is used to modify the overall skin textures. Coming next, I will talk about the shader setting in part 2. Then, I will talk about the component of skin gen in part 3. If you still interest in learning the tutorials, please sign up my site. And you will get the first end video soon. See you next time.